Karen Kachanov paid tribute to his Russian fans and addressed a ban on his nation's flags following his Australian Open exit. It comes after Novak Djokovic's dad caused controversy by posing with two pro-Putin protesters. Karen Kachanov addressed the Australian Open's ban on Russian flags following his semi-final defeat on Friday. The 18th seed fell to Stefano Tsitsipas in four sets but shared a poignant moment with the crowd before leaving Rod Laver Arena and explained how he felt supported by the Russian fans despite the nation's flag being banned earlier in the tournament. It comes after four pro-Putin protesters were kicked out of the grounds following Andrei Rublev's quarterfinal loss to Novak Djokovic. Kachanov paid tribute to his Russian and Armenian supporters after crashing out of the Australian Open in the semi-final. The 26-year-old had used his camera messages in the earlier rounds to send support to Artsakh amid Armenia's claims that the breakaway republic had been blockaded by Azerbaijan, and on Friday he also thanked the fans from his home nation. After losing 7-6-2-6-4-6-7-6-6-3, the world number 20 noticeably put his bags down to wave to the fans before leaving the court and was asked about the emotional moment. I felt really during the tournament a lot of fans, he explained. I had some matches on John Kane. Actually the fans were cheering more for my opponents. Then I think last match on Rod Laver and this one, they were really kind of almost equal. They gave me so much love. I just wanted to appreciate this moment to some Russian fans, to my Armenian fans, and people who came to support with the flags. Following Kachanov's messages to Artsakh, fans brought both Armenian and Artsakh flags to the four-time title winners' matches and he commented on the fact that the Russian fans had been unable to do the same. Grateful for them to cheer, to support, to come over, he continued. And also Russian fans, they were not allowed to bring any flags, Belarusian as well. But I heard them as well. There were many Russians as well screaming and supporting me all the way. Just really happy to see everybody on that court and to give me love all the way until the end. Russian and Belarusian flags, as well as the Z symbol, were banned from the tournament after day one when a Russian flag was clearly visible during a match between the country's Kamila Rakimova and Ukraine's Katerina Baindel, prompting the Ukrainian ambassador to Australia and New Zealand to complain.